Laura. Uh, another big win in the Melbourne Derby last yeah. week. What did you make of the performance? Uh, it was good. It was hard to break him down initially, but once we got there, we started finding our rhythm and things. the goal started to come, so it was good. So the conditions were tough. There was a late change in venue, the synthetic surface, and obviously um, warm weather as well. How difficult was it to adjust to those conditions at the last minute? Yeah, look, I think as part of being a professional athlete, you just have to take it as it comes, and um, I hear the other ground wasn't that great, so at least we had a flat pitch. It's never ideal to play on synthetic, but uh, and with such a hot day and with our internationals just coming back with a bit of jet lag, it was there was a number of things that sort of slowed us down a little bit, but we still come away from, with the win, so we're happy with that. Um, Larissa Crummer was among the goals again with another double, <laughs> taking a tally to ten so far this year. How important has she been in the final third for City this year? Yeah, she's been unreal. Like she's just been getting into really good positions, and like you said, she's that's her job. She's got to score goals, and she's doing it. So. Credit to her, she's been excellent for us. Team's also been pretty rock solid in defence as well, only conceding the three goals this year. Have you rated Don't the performance? <laughs> Have you rated the performance so far from the defensive unit? Yeah, look, it's coming along now. I think after a few weeks to get used to each other, but now having Jen Beatty, who's world class, next to me, and then obviously Rebecca Stott's been pushed out to right back, but she's brilliant anywhere along the back line. And I mean, the likes of Steph Catley is always going to be brilliant. So we're finally kind of finding our little niche a little bit and uh, getting on the same page, and it's been solid. Uh, attention turns to Newcastle this Sunday, the chance to make it eight wins on the on the spin. How's the team shaping up for this weekend? Yeah, really good. We've only had one session. Uh, well, a hard session it was, though. Um, we've got another session today and a couple more to prepare, but I'm sure Joe's got plenty in store for us, and he'll nut out all the fine details in the next few sessions and prepare us as best we can. Awesome. All the best. Thank you.